Daniel Bosco. A big part of what we do is just to make people better. We try to make you as fit as possible, and the way we do that is by doing a little bit of everything. So we bike, run, row, swim, long distance, short distance, medium distance, um, kettlebell work, uh, barbell work, gymnastics, etc. The biggest thing with CrossFit, it has a little bit of a, of a stigma attached to it where people are like, oh, it's either too intense or potentially too dangerous or things like that. You don't have to be an athlete. You could be somebody who's never worked out a day in your life, um, or you could be somebody with a world of athletic experience. We started off in like a 1,500 square foot box uh, with just a few of us. Uh, we grew and grew, so we went to about a 5,000 square foot place, and now we're at an over 10,000 square foot facility. We have a CrossFit room, uh, we have a more strength focused room, we have a Olympic lifting specific room, physio, Cairo, massage, you name it, we got it, we do it. I love doing business in Windsor. I think Windsor's a great place. I'm a, I'm a big Windsor fan, and it's a really nice kind of symbiotic relationship that we have with a lot of other small businesses in the city, and uh, anything we can do to help them grow, and anything they can do to help us, of course, would be, would be great, and uh, everybody wins in the end. Being a young entrepreneur is in my blood, so it just kind of comes natural to me. Being a leader kind of comes natural to me as well. I've been a leader on multiple sports teams I've been in in the past. Um, I do like to lead by example. With our team, I really pride myself in giving them a lot of autonomy in what they do, um, and I just like to facilitate their growth, uh, their talents, and their expertise, and kind of let them do what they need to do in our facility, and I'm just kind of a guiding hand to help grow them. Jennifer Sharon. I'm a mom of two little boys, and I, I remember people telling me, you, you either have to choose. You have to be a really good mom or a really good career woman. I wanted to be both. I started with Lucas Works about six years ago. Uh, we took a lot of notice that there were customers, not just locally, but throughout southwestern Ontario, that really needed support, not just with uh, professional and management level talent, but with executive management talent. So we launched Lucas Professional Search Group in 2013, specifically dedicated to executive level placements. Being the only recruiter when I started in our professional services division to being able to now service customers throughout southwestern Ontario and into the U.S., um, we've come a long way in just a few short years. Um, our goal is to expand that reach and to deliver our excellent customer service to people outside of those boundaries as well. It is an amazing feeling to be able to help people, especially help people and organizations locally. We get it. We get that great people make great companies and to be able to help companies locally and outside of our area be able to find the people who will help their businesses maintain themselves and to grow and to thrive coupled with being able to help candidates land their dream jobs. That's an amazing feeling. I am so proud of uh, our team and the level of service that we deliver. And when I can find the right person for the right company, uh, the first time I've, I've done a good job and I've delivered that level of service. Marla Coffin. Marta Management is a full service property management company. The way that our company got started was actually a little bit on accident. Uh, it started as a bit of a side job. My husband and myself decided to be on site managers at a multifamily property of 20 units, and from there things just snowballed. So we've grown from what originated uh, just over five years ago as about 30 units or 35 units under management to just over 1,200 units today. Being born and raised in Windsor has really uh, enhanced my value system as it relates directly to our surrounding community. To own and operate a business that impacts people at such a variety of areas in their life is really, really an honor because it allows both myself, my husband, and all of my staff to be very widely in touch with uh, people in many different areas of life. We've also had the opportunity and in fact pleasure of placing almost 50% of the Syrian refugees that have come to the Windsor area. Um, it's been a real honor to be able to be part of that operation, both as a Windsorite, as a Canadian, and as a business owner. 
As a Windsor-based business, we like to use local companies, local vendors, local construction companies, local suppliers, that in turn helps infuse quite a bit into the local economy. And it's really nice to know that our company is not only contributing by our day-to-day -day operations of managing rental properties and being good landlords, but also by infusing funds into those different companies that surround us and that are also share our community with us.